Ladies, have you ever experienced or noticed that your period flow suddenly reduces anytime you take painkillers for cramps? Well, you are not just imagining it. There's a real science behind it, which I will explain in this video. And if today is your first time on my channel, you are so, so welcome. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Here, we talk about real and relatable health topics that matters to you. Now, to the subject matter. But why does your flow slow down whenever you take pain class? I know that some of you ladies might be curious to know why is it that anytime I take ibuprofen, my flow suddenly reduces or decreases, or in some cases it even ceases? Don't worry, I will explain. You see, during menstruation, your uterus, which is your wound, produces a natural chemical called prostaglandin. What this prostaglandin does is that they cause the walls of the uterus to contract to help it shade the uterine lining. Now, the shading of the uterine lining is what brings about the blood you see. When prostaglandin levels are high, you can experience strong cramps and heavy breathing. Now, here is a cool part. This is what painkillers actually do. Painkillers like your NSAID, your non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, like your ibuprofen, your diclofenac. These drugs work by blocking the action of the enzyme called cyclooxygenase. The enzyme needed for the production of prostaglandin. Now, if you could recall previously, I said when prostaglandin levels are high, you can experience stronger cramps and heavier bleeding. These enzymes, like ibuprofen, diclofenac, and their brothers, works by blocking the enzyme that produces prostaglandin. And when this happens, it leads to less uterine contraction and less blood vessels dilation. Painkillers makes your uterus to relax more, contract less, and your blood vessels to tighten up, meaning lesser blood flow, less pain. So as a result of this, misery flow decreases and misery cramp reduces. Now, you may be wondering, is it okay, is it good taking painkillers during periods? Taking painkillers during your periods is generally safe particularly when used as directed. Just avoid taking them at high doses and for a prolonged period. But if your period is too light and irregular, talk to your doctor just to rule out any other causes like hormonal changes or uterine lining issues. And again, not all painkillers are the same. Like paracetam or paracetam or is pain, but it doesn't block prostaglandin much like the way it prevent does. So it doesn't affect your flow much. If you're seeing your period and you don't want to take painkillers, you can try heat therapy. Just use a hot water bottle or a heat pad. Place it on your lower abdomen. This helps your uterine muscle to relax and improve blood flow, which reduces cramp. When you step into the shower, let that warm water, allow that warm water to flow gently over your lower abdomen. Whether you're using a hand shower, a standing shower, or a cupping water in your hands, allow that water to pour gently on your lower abdomen. This helps to relax uterine muscles and reduce painful misery cramp. Yes, it works. In fact, studies show that heat can relieve cramp effectively as a profane for some women no? emphasis on some women emphasis on some women because some ladies once this their period comes out what they need is emergency because the kind of pain they experience is very excruciating and to be honest it's not normal and if a lady here watching me you do experience excruciating pain you experience painful mazes anytime your period comes out it is horrible you can't eat you can't sit, you can't sleep. I just want you to know that it's not normal. It's not normal. Seek for medical attention. Talk to your daughter. Don't die in silence. If you find my video helpful, give it a thumbs up. Make sure to like and subscribe.